Morning folks, welcome to a stream. I think I might have an issue by the way with my uh, PC going on. Fortunately. So, Streamlabs has done an update this morning before I went to start a stream and I noticed straight away that the CPU usage when sitting idle was so much higher than normal. Normally when it's sitting idle, it'll just be sitting at like using 1% CPU, but it was sitting using 10% CPU this morning. And I think it might be using too much CPU for this stream to run smoothly now. I know the intro wasn't running smoothly there. I'll have to just see how it goes when I'm running. Running some races. But, uh, morning to you folks, welcome along. I have no idea what's going on with uh, Streamlabs there using all that CPU for no reason. But morning to James, Aaron, Dan, Nay, Woody Boy. Hope you're all well, folks. Welcome along to the stream. Uh, we are at Watkins Glen. We're in the Porsche, Group 4. Porsche at Cayman. Yeah, I went to Ohio in there. On the usage, let me know if the actual when we're. Uh, when we're racing, if it's running smoothly, we get Cyrus in here. In the Citroen. Jack's in the Supra. Ali's in. Yeah, that's a pain. I've no idea why he's doing it. I mean, it's sitting at 40... 46% is fine. But when I start racing, it might be a bit more. It goes up above like 65, 60, 70. Will not run it smoothly. DB, how you doing? Welcome in. Ali, nice to see you, mate. Nice to see you. Have a good luck in the race, mate. Good luck. I did a race in this car last night and uh, I quite like it but my god for a Porsche it absolutely chews the tyres up. Absolutely chews the tyres up. Something rotten. Noble, welcome in. Start me on the limiter, wasn't it? Left already. Positions that we get in, we alphas off and ooh, one at second penalty. Oh, 
up in the wall. <sighs> hey, that. So you got a car that is so stupid to put entry here. So stupid. I can't imagine it's like that in real life. Right, damage is fixed. Now let me go on to the right screen so I can actually see the chat now. Welcome in everyone. Appreciate your company. I hope the stream is running smoothly. I'm not convinced it is. I think the I think Streamlabs updated something and it's faked my settings or something, I don't know. Flashdagger, how you doing? I have my back's better, DB. It's not 100%, it's definitely better. Appreciate you asking. Appreciate that, Nate. Appreciate that. Just let us know. My tire wear in this was absolutely awful last night, so it was. The No idea why the tyre was so bad in the course game, but let's uh, let's see how it's looking as the, the race goes on. Have you really, buddy boy? It just comes and goes. It's, it's just kind of some bad lifting techniques when I was younger, I think. Not as bad now as it used to be. I used to hurt it a lot more often than what I do now. That's a Corvette in the street and a Porsche, that is the, that is the question, I have no idea. Neil, welcome in. Pretty slow this guy. Even I say so myself, that was nicely done.
What can we have stick since you were 32? We back home, you know, geez, oh. All that sitting in the cop. In the cold. James. This Porsche does drive absolutely sublime though, so it does. Looks a nice driving car. The way it rotates into the first corner is just a thing of beauty. No idea right, it's such a beast on the tyres though. <laughs> I had a few cars last night, Aston Martin, Ferrari, this, what else did I try, did I try something else? Maybe that was all I tried, but unbelievably the Porsche was the worst on the bloody tyres. Guy will pit. Yeah, he's pitting. Oh, he's even telling me he's pitting him. It's kind of cool, isn't it? Oh, I did twice this race. It cost me at least two seconds, bloody cars pitting in front of me. I hit the wall the first time. Flash, how are you doing? Welcome in. You'll be doing some of this, James, won't you? You'll have a bit of walking glen. Maybe not actually, I'm just reading the rest of your message. Hey, well, well, I'm doing great, mate. Sleep deprived. Oh, well, first child was born Saturday or Sunday night. Wow. <laughs> Welcome to a different world, then, James, eh? Welcome to a different world. Congratulations, though. Girl to bit. Ah, to be fair, the first few, the first sort of years, okay, because you can just kind of cradle them in your arms while you're playing games, and they kind of you move about. I used to play Call of Duty with my daughter, kind of cradled in my arms. I think that would just keep her sleeping and keep her occupied. A bit like sitting there with a control like that with her cradle there. Love it. Forgot to break. Forgot to break. <laughs>
four or five. I'm not sure, I'm even sure that's true in the four or five years. <laughs> I don't think we're all a very good result here by the way folks, we've not, uh, not had the best luck with the people going into the pits and I've made a mistake in turn one, my tyres are toast, they're, they're going to be toast, they're okay at the moment but the last two laps are going to be terrible. What are you doing? Well, congratulations, James. As everybody said, enjoy the first. Enjoy it because it, the time flies in before you know it. But walking about. Before you know it, they'll be going to school, so yeah, enjoy it. That's all I'll say. I think we were lucky to be in the top 10 here. Let's see, I'm not expecting very much from this one. The guy in seventh had this. Daughter's almost two, and her first words were car, football, and tree, James. So just. I do feel we got screwed by those kind of people pitting in front of because we'd be up probably, probably ahead of those four cars ahead of us, certainly well in, a, in the mix with them. The last half I have anything to offer the Porsche. Porsche is so heavy on the front tyres. Crazy. 
And I say that because I was using it, I used the Aston Martin for a couple of races yesterday. I'm pretty sure I'd pay off the tire wear on the Aston Martin. Driver. What is going on there? The Jack's got a four second pair and there was a couple of positions for free at the end. Take us up to P8. Ali takes to P7. Cyrus up in P3. How'd, how'd that turn right by the way is uh, Tarana saw Cyrus Rex. Just for the American streamer. He's probably be quite familiar with him. Take a, we'll take a P, a P8 after that. Eat twin girls with the boy. Eleven years old. Seems like yesterday my daughter was eleven. She's fourteen. Now. Jack, uh, I wonder what's going on there with Jack and got Ixtor. I feel like I need to go and take a look and see what's went on there. Super Yuku, welcome to the stream. You still going around to special stage route X? Said here. Then we're going to take a look at the replay and see what went down. Let's go take a look at it. Let's see what happened at the last corner there. I think maybe something's been on previously. What's, uh, what's everybody thinking of this race anyway? Um, they got, uh, anybody, anybody enjoying it? I'm, I think it's quite a good little race, but I do feel like the Alpha Romeo 4C has, has ruined it. You're gonna, what was nice about this race here, there's a very few of them in the race, but last night playing top split, the, the tyre wear on the 4C is just absolutely ridiculous. Was there any previous though, Ali? They have like some kind of previous altercation because... Tire wear on the out. I mean, this guy's not changed tires by the way. And look at his tire wear compared to Jack that has changed tires. Jack's changed tires in the Supra. This guy's not changed tires in the Alpha. It's like the tire wear is literally half as, half as bad. Ali in the car, Alpha. Ah, then, Alpha. David, welcome in. Still not done with it, you live on Route X. <laughs> I mean, I see you did that other video. I see you did your other video and used Route X as well. I was like, oh. But yeah, the AI cheats. <laughs> the AI definitely cheats. It then cheats itself. Send. That's a send. 
take a look at this one then. Have you missed anything? Just the first race, David. Just the first race. It's such a short braking zone that... It's such a short braking zone that, you know, you have to be considerably closer than that. What do you mean disconnected? It's connected. Such a short braking zone, you can't send it from there. You've got to at least have a some kind of run on the car in front. So he's launched it, absolutely launched it. Why is this disconnecting? Oh, two sex folks. Why it is not connected at the other end, that's why. So, I don't think this move was on, personally. I suspect this is why Jack was uh, somewhat pissed off when it comes to the next couple of corners. System works though, folks. Penalty okay, system. System works. He still finished the head of him. Even with the four second penalty, he still finished the head. <laughs> this is why you've got to be careful and measured with your overtakes, people, because if you piss somebody off, that's what happens. Right, is there anything in the used car dealership that I've not bought in my quest to have every car in the game? Is there any new cars for me? Yeah, good luck with that then. Good luck with that. Is there anything in here that I can buy, that I can afford? <laughs> We're up to date on the cars. We've got all the cars. I think I've got 20 cars that I need, 20 cars left to buy. Although I think about 10 of them are worth 20 million credits, which is... Uh. Uh, right, I'll do another one in the Porsche. I'll do another one, see if we can maybe work on the tire rear a little bit and try and... Try and improve it. Marks, how you doing? Welcome in. I'm really annoyed at that bum and so annoyed that Streamlabs does an update and all of a sudden I get so much worse CPU usage. I wonder what it is. I wonder what's done that. It doesn't make any sense. What do PCs do for you? PCs just don't make any sense. They're absolute buggers. Yeah, that's pretty much similar with me, Woody Boy. I think most of them are legend cars, and uh, I still need to get the invite for the Bugatti Chiron, and there's a, an invite for something else that I need to get as well. Maybe a, one of the Aston Martin cars? Do you need an invite for one of the Aston Martins? Anyway, I better say hello uh, to the, the, the child who's woke up, so I better make sure she's alright. I'll just put this one on mute. Ben, welcome, welcome to the stream. Over a year to get the Bugatti invite, I mean... 
I'm not sure whether I've actually had it at some point, Woody Boy, and not used it, or if I've just never had it. Because they do expire, don't they? Daughter told me yesterday her new boyfriend is huge in sim racing and GT is his sim and he's very good, so she said. Uh, so I said I'll be the judge of that. Oh, wonder if it's anyone we know, Neil. Wonder if it's anyone we know. Imagine it's Kimmy. <laughs> hey, Aston Martin is pretty decent, David. Yep, I used it in a couple of races. I kind of have to change the tyres with it, though. Not ideal. I wonder if I've already met him on YouTube. I know, Neil. I know. That could be awkward, couldn't it? That could be awkward. Oh, business is picked up at the back of the grid. We've got Grove. Grove, Rory, Lewis. Cyrus is back. Ali's back in. Tommy's in. Bullets is in. Looks spongy up the front. Not a bad grid actually for half past nine in the morning. See? Not a bad grid. Kingdom. Literally all way plus for the half past nine race on Tuesday. That's not bad in Ali. Ali is fast enough. He's one of the A drivers. We know he's got the pace. In the water. <laughs> if you told them to, yeah, uh, if you told no, I was going to see you could, uh, so you could ask if she's using anybody's uh, affiliate link to it. Uh, to buy the gear. There's not that many wheels that you can spend over £1,000 on, is there? Gran Turismo 7. Right, let's go again. Scotty, welcome in, how you doing? If they haven't already spent 1k, you don't believe they're that big. <laughs> oh my god! Acceleration of the Jaguar. That monster munch livery on this is a horsey.
struggling in that, isn't he? Lewis is faster than me, but he's definitely struggling in that 4C. Struggling in it. The cockroach cars in front of me. The, the, the 4C has joined the cockroach category as far as I'm concerned. I feel like swatting them all off the track. One after the other. Swat, swat, swat. Cluster, isn't it? There's a cluster. Right. Good try, something different here. We change the tyres because I'm having good tyres at the end, right? Hopefully they're just going to kick the crap out of each other. This is a, a calculated strategy call that might pay off and prob but probably won't, but let's give it a go. They call me Fat Super GT. <laughs> yeah, you could be called worse to be fair. Red Fox, how are you doing? Are there are morgues, probably away by now, but I see ya. The off gate coming in. John Gisby, welcome to the stream. I can't say it's a name I, I recognise before, John. Is it your first time here? So, welcome along. Appreciate it. You'll find that a friendly place. I see you're also a channel member, so... Not your first time here. That one up there, strategy might pay off, you never know, stranger things have happened, gaming sounds like a mosquito. I wouldn't say that about my game in Tonic. I don't know what to call the Alpha 4C, but I mean, the, 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 the trophy's the cockroach. What's that equally horrible bug that nobody likes that can call the 4C? I was actually thinking of the mosquito because obviously the Four C's Italian, isn't it? And I got absolutely bitten to bits years ago by 
Italian mosquitoes. Four C could get the title of the mosquito. A mosquito kind of sounds like good. See if you call something a mosquito, it's fast and dangerous. The mosquito is quite a good name. It's like a famous World War II plane called the mosquito. I don't think the name's quite insulting enough. <laughs> no, well, just just Italian mosquitoes. Uh, I would say it's the other way around, anyway. I would say it's the other way around. Uh, or I think Italian drivers have something against me. I work with Big Spongy here in the Jaguar. Oh, I've tried body body bump draft, eh? Why is your jag here so slow? Get an oil change on that and sponge it. Jaguar slipstream will be pretty good though. Poor lit. <laughs> the Varen's a dung beetle, yeah. <laughs> I can actually see that. Yeah, what was it for me? Because my cars are slower than everybody else's, yeah. 100% David. I scientifically prove that to be true, so... Through there, so he did. Send it through there. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody, though. Appreciate your company. Forty six people in. I was looking at his car, rather where I was going. Sponge is kind of fast, except for that last corner, isn't it? Not quite at that last corner down. It's 
Spud is probably going, why is this Porsche able to stay with me even though he's not changed the tyres? I've changed the tyres. Don't defend, don't defend, don't defend, don't defend, don't defend. Why am I going to, why are you defending at this point? Alley up ahead and a GTR struggling on the tiles. Get the last corner right this time. There you are, there you are, there you are. Right, two to go. There's a great deal for us and I think having to change the tyres in this car just maybe not the way to go, is it? It's too much of a time loss as I thought. Don't you even think about it again. Well, it's not last. <laughs> we make it up to 13th. We had only 8 seconds off the lead as well down in P14, which is a bit crazy. Oh, it's a pen for both of them. I don't know how big sponges not get a pen Oh, 
got it right in the back there, Ali. It was so hard to judge what was going on. Ten seconds off the lead in P12 after 17 minutes of racing though. It's quite close out there, isn't it? I mean, we lost two seconds on the last lap as well. It'd have been more like eight seconds off the lead down in P12. It's very, very congested, very competitive, very close. Right. What are we talking about here then? Get one back in here in New Zealand that we talk about mosquitoes. Horrible things. I absolutely bit into bits by them. Uh, it was my kind of my own fault because the air conditioning or whatever was annoying me in the hotel. So like I switched it off and opened the window and then get bitten to bits by uh, mosquitoes. So kind of my own fault a little bit, but my god, it wasn't like just little kind of pinprick bites, the kind of like I came out in whales, like fifty pence pieces on my face, on my arms, my legs, but I know it was I was miserable for a week after it, I can assure you. Yeah, I mean, I was kind of just changing tyres on the second lap, poo poo, just so that, that the tyres would be good to for the, the rest of the race, because as long as you keep the sort of tyre wear below 50%, the tyres kind of perform pretty much spot on, so they do it. So that was that was the thinking of it. it kind of it almost worked to be fair. I mean, we're in the fight, weren't we? We were in the fight for. You know, we'd only, as I said, we'd only been eight seconds off the lead, so we're kind of in the fight for a P six, P seven. Just losing, losing a bit of time. Oh, I know, tonic. I know. Yes, right, it was a bit. I, I kind of put a comment in a race, it's like, why is all the aliens driving the OP car? Surely aliens should be driving other cars to even the playing field, but... Yeah, I did notice that tonic, yeah. Yeah. That's why I think I was in second split for quite a lot of races though, tonic, so it wasn't so bad, but yeah, that one race I did in top split, I was like... Come on. Doreen, welcome to the stream as well. Anyone <laughs> know a Liverpool fan who uses a walking stick with a girl who says her dad is really into some racing? So fine, <laughs> and you really... Nay, that is brilliant. Love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> love it. That was a good race though, enjoyable, enjoyable. As long as it doesn't mean... I don't mind, it's just the four C's that are an issue. I don't mind the fact the Citroen's quite good on tyres, because it's not like stupidly good on the tyres. Same with the McLaren, but... Uh, I think uh, I think my motto for the week is going to be, if you're in a 4C, you get absolutely no respect or sympathy from me. If you're in the 4C, you get no mercy from me this week. That's the, That's my message. Come at me. Come at me. Uh, right. You know what I want to try? I want to try the NSX. So let's jump into the NSX. Let's try the NSX. Some good tickets here. Let's open a couple of tickets. Say no more going 4C tonight. <laughs> Let's see it. Especially a standard livery 4C. I mean that's just the ultimate. If you if you're in a standard livery 4C, you've got no respect for yourself, let alone expect respect for me. If you put a livery on it, I might kinda of have a second thought about putting you off. 
Demo, how you doing? No, the Mustang. Imagine the Mustang on the front tires, David. Imagine. Travisio, welcome in. Ditching in this section well matched here, force you just OP tie where gets advantage at the last few laps. Yeah, I mean it's not even like a it's like such a ridiculously massive advantage though, Tonic, is so it the tire wear's so low on it, it's like you might as well not have any tire wear. That's not a bad price. Feel that. Let's see what we get from our six star. Will it be good? ET Ivor as well, welcome in. I will take half a million credits, it's definitely not the worst. Oh yeah, maybe I should start calling. I could start calling you GTIs to the GT Ivor. <laughs> I've never noticed that GTI VR6R. Right, I'll start calling you GTI now instead of Ivor. I like Ivor as a name though. Ivor's a good name. Alright, where's my NSX? There it is. See, everybody seems to be, seems to have adopted calling the Citroen the Shiptron. <laughs> I like the Citroen. I loved that Citroen back in uh, Grand Turismo Sport when nobody used it. Yes, yeah, GTI works, nice, no way. I'm terrible for doing that, honestly. I'll look at people's PSN names and just kind of make up my own iteration of what I'm going to call people rather than kind of like calling them by what the obvious bit of the name is. So for like example, I mean, I didn't really see one there that kind of They find one there, you know. See, like that guy, the best thing to call that guy would be Mantis, wouldn't it? But I'll be like, Psycho, Psycho. They're just calling him Mantis, which is the easy way to say his name. I do it all the time. Anyways, let's, uh, ooh. Pedro, welcome in. John Connery's section, yes. Shiptron. There we go to the rear on the brake balance tonic. I always go to the rear, so. Hey, doing wind, welcome in. I was watching a wee bit of your quest to 100k DR yesterday, so I was. I think you got up to. Is it up to 98k wind? It looked a bit boring for you though. People are thinking they're going to need a 100k DR to get into top split when the official season starts then. <laughs> well, I'd say I'll see you in the next race wind, but maybe after the start you'll be 
maybe only for the first couple of corners you might be a wee spake in the distance. But I take it that's why you're doing it, because you think uh, you're going to need 100 k DR to get into top split for the official. understeer's quite a lot more than the quite a lot more than the Porsche to be honest with you. <laughs> Tell me not in the 4C win. I don't think you'll need the 4C to win in these lobbies win. I think you could win in any car at the moment, to be fair. Right, wind is up there. P1, McSponge's in the Jaguar again. We've got Bjorn in the Citroen. Well, it's in the Citroen. We, we, just, we just go over them if they're in a 4C. Right, Grove's in the Supra. Lewis in the Citroen, oh, my, my best friend, Velasa, in a 4C, that, that's tempting by the way, that's tempting after his behaviour against me and uh, Bathurst, that's very tempting, I'm going to have to have quite a lot of restraint into a couple of corners here. Cyrus is back as well. Susie, welcome in. I've no idea, Demo. I really don't have any idea. I wonder if they maybe have some kind of secondary selection where it kind of works out who got there first. I don't know. I really don't know, Demo. Because there is a, let's be honest, there's a pretty good chance there's going to be more than 16 people with a 100k DR by the time they get to the official season. Yeah, I mean the Lambo was good back in the fuel saving races, Torrick, remember? Yeah, if I see one little bit of dodgy behaviour from Velasa, he's getting it. Doesn't have to be against me. I see one dodgy bit of behaviour from him, he's getting punted. Shit, my brakes aren't working. My brakes. Why is my brake pedal not working? Kingdom. Oh. Is that 
can't go in there with the same uh, speed as I can with the Porsche. Sorry for holding you up. Only about one second, barely all right, so. Oh, he's got one second as well. We need to stop cheating. This should be pretty good on the tyre, shouldn't I? Right, this is much better than the Porsche. This is pretty good, this car, isn't it? This is pretty fast, this thing. So slow for. Hmm. Again, I'm getting compromised by people pitting in front of me. It's a pain in the backside. Maybe it was good on this, isn't it? It's a borderline one.
We might have to punt him off if he comes up behind me. Trouble pit. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it doesn't feel particularly fast tonic, but the lap times suggest it is pretty good. Dean Crusher, how you doing? Welcome in. Muse as well, welcome in. I kind of wanted to get ahead of this guy here, but I didn't want the last of it, me. Lewis behind us, so Lewis will be on fresh tyres. Otherwise, he plus friends is coming. I wasn't expecting him to gear that up, thank you very much. I was not expecting that. Seconds behind Cyrus, not bad. Such is not bad.
Giske, er I døde? Jeg havde brugt en star. Jeg vil se, at I døde dem bare ikke. Now, I bet Groh's got no fun tires on that Supra if he's not changed the tires. Groh likes to wear a tire out, so he does. He's fighting with a bull, driving style. Happy Wombo. We need one of to crash. Actually, Kevin, I imagine that front left dead on Grove's car. Put the pace up. Actually, not far off P2. Obviously, the wind's just uh, decimated everyone. But on Grove, keep it in there. Keep it in there. Let's uh, see how good his uh, let's see how good his tire is. in the stars folks, it was written in the stars. Written in the stars, wind with absolute decimation of everyone. Only 4.3 seconds off P2 folks, not too shabby at all. That's a good car the NSX, keeps the tyres alive nicely. Doesn't feel fast but does the lap times. Alright, I've missed so much of the chat folks, I do apologise. He's talk, uh, talk way too much, I can't keep up. 
What's the say? Misery for three friends list is missing many entries that I can see on the PS5 home screen in the PSN app. The list is out of sync. Does anybody else have the same problem or tips on how to fix it? Never heard of that one, Susie. I'm not going to lie. Never heard of that one. I mean, the only, I mean, the problem, if you want to fix any kind of problems like that, usually the best thing is just to reinstall the game, but you will lose all your replays and all your, well, that's all you'll lose. You'll lose your replays, but everything else will remain the same. <coughs> it does sound like a kind of sort of thing where something's got corrupted somewhere, so a, wee, uh, a reinstall might be your best bet, but it depends on your internet because it's like a hundred and odd, hundred odd gigabytes of download for... Grand Turismo 7, so. So, how did that go? Wind wins easy. Tommy, uh, well, actually, Tommy takes the win in the Citroen. And then Cyrus in P2. Well, it's P3. That was a P4 for me, actually. P5 for Grove. We don't count 4Cs. Thank, bro. Welcome to the stream, by the way. The Anton as well, welcome into the stream. Over 50 likes as well, folks. Thank you very much for that. Yeah, thank bro, yeah. That's the first time I've used the NSX and I'll definitely be using it again because it's uh, really nice to drive. <laughs> really nice to drive and keeps the tyres alive much better than the, the Cayman. No worries, Susie. Enjoy your work. Telmo, welcome in. Came back to see a scripted P7 as <laughs> so, well. I know, I know. What can I say? I've, I might have another rather epic P7 to show you members out there later on in the week for my race last night. I had a very nice race last night for P7. I've kind of spoiled it a little bit, but honestly, you're going to see me driving in a way that you might not ever have seen me drive before, so definitely worth a wee, uh, a wee members video. Hugo, welcome in to the Four Seas, the new cockroach, yeah. We're trying to think of it, give it its own personality, Hugo. Try to think of something equally disgusting as a cockroach to call it. Uh, yeah, NSX though. Nice. Now that we're kind of used to it, we should be a little bit better in race two. and do the necessary with it. Is that a Mr. Pouch? Is it Mr. Pouch? Are you there? Apparently not. What I hear behind me. See, Tonic, how can you possibly expect anyone to use a car that's not in the top 10 in the leaderboard? Probably is one in the top 10, what do you see? I mean, you realise what you're asking people to do, Tonic. There's not even one in the top 100. Oh, well, there we go, 1991. Nobody gets down that far though before they go. This is what you're. I'm only kidding here, folks, right? I'm just having a bit of banter. This is what your average Gran Turismo player does. F type! F type, find F type. Where's my F type? F type, race, 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 all week. I'm only kidding on. Taking the pass. I'm not saying everyone's a sheep. Well, actually, I, I kind of am. To be fair, there's not a lot of F types in the race, is there? <laughs> there's not a lot of F types. Right, I am going to go and get myself some juice, folks. <laughs> 
Well, we're back for race four. We've got the P7 out of the way. I think the controllers went off earlier on as well, so we're doing quite well on the Womble Bingo front as well. Uh, but I'll be back in a minute, folks. And we're back. Wombo the sheep, Sean the sheep. I'm in from butter sheep. I do like the Jaguar, David, I do. I love the Jaguar. Remember the time trial we had here, the Jaguar was easily the fastest car, so it doesn't surprise me it's up at the top. It really doesn't. Else is up there. That Veyron looks so fast in the uh, yesterday at times as well. But uh, I absolutely choose that you have to change tyres in the Veyron. 100% have to change tyres on that. The M4 up there in P22, that's quite interesting. That's not a car you see very often. Now has got the Corvette up there. Huracan's up there as well. I say up there. I mean, it's not far off, is it? Two attempts. Yeah, I've seen him racing yesterday as well, though, and I uh, don't often see him in a race, but he, he was doing some good races yesterday from the back. We're going to dispute, see the top, pick the car, most of us need a ghost to learn. Only top time to ghosts. Very restricted in cars you can pick. Mm. Well then, do you have ghosts in real life, nay? Well, <laughs> do you have ghosts when you practice a, a track? That sounds like a you problem, not a me problem. I'm only kidding on. People can race what they want. I'm only, I'm only having a bit of fun. KCR Mark, welcome in. Fifty-two two in the day, yeah. I seen uh, a race I did yesterday. I think Willits was in the Veyron, and it literally after four laps had about 
40% left in the tyres after four laps, so, but it was bloody fast. Right, whoa, they're going to have a race at the front, so they are. Wind, Manu Audrey, Key, Sponge is giving up on the Jaguar. Kingdom's done a qualifying time. Moves in the Citroen this time. Jack behind is in the Supra. Oh, Nafe's in, in the 4C. I could go bowling. I could go, how many have I got in front? One, two, three, four. I could go bowling into turn one. See, I don't use ghosts, neither I do, but I am going to do a video. I'm going to do a video in the future where I'm going to, I'm going to kind of try hard a time trial without a ghost. Then I'm going to start following the P1 in the world's ghost and see if I can actually find a couple of attempts through the power of the ghost. There's a lot of people swear by it, don't they? A lot of people swear by following a ghost makes you faster, but it's not, ever, it's not something I've ever really tried out. Let's, uh, let's go to the rear a little bit more this time, see if we... Fair, you, you don't have to follow the same car as a ghost, you could follow, you know. If more following the ghost for the lines more than anything else, aren't you? I'm the same poo poo, yeah, I think that distraction. I know obviously you can say it the ghost so it's not kinda distracting you as much, but Imagine I managed to overtake the fastest driver in the world at the moment, or the fastest driver in the last time trial in the world at the moment. Absolutely screwed here, these are all going to pit, aren't they? All going to pit and I'm like absolutely screwed by it. <laughs> I mean, I, I couldn't have made a, a worse job of it to be fair, but. Up there. 
said it was key, it was round. You gotta be joking. Welcome to the stream. Most of the main reason some people can't race in traffic, possibly Doric. Suddenly, I arrive at turn one in a different line to the normal. Yeah, you could be, could be right, sorry. You know the reason I don't use ghosts and why I don't really watch the number one times in the leaderboard. I don't watch any lap guides either. I want to know how fast I am rather than. I want to know. Yeah, I want to learn the car. I want to learn the track. I want to learn the tricks myself. I want to know genuinely what is my pace. All I've got is me in the track and I've got to learn myself, I, that's what I kind of want to know that, rather than just find out everything from somebody else, if you know what I mean. I mean it's fine, yeah, after a while, yeah, okay, right, I need to try and find some more pace, maybe, let's, uh, let's see what we're doing wrong or what we could be doing differently, but initially, yeah, I like to just sort of, I want to see where I am genuinely in the pecking order. Usually quite far down it. the grass. Braced for impact there. Oh definitely Tori, definitely. Definitely, yeah. And I will admit there's been a couple of times in a time trial, particularly with road cars where I've kind of went, eh, WTF, why am I so slow here? Or maybe watch the Tensions Guide or something. And I'll be like, oh right, yeah. I think of that because, you know, Maybe if I did start watching number one lap times and ghosts and stuff, maybe I'd actually be faster than what I have. Bullshit panel, it'll give it empty says that's a bullshit one. But that one yesterday as well when I was raging. as well staying in this train and getting the slurpy. Well, you can't deny it, this week close racing anyway, can we? It's, the racing's going to be close all week in this one, so... 
was definitely an entertainment value to it. I'm not being critical of it, Jay. I'm just sad. Uh, I said last stream, you know, it's a tool that's there to be used, so. Jeez, are so slow. Well, the last couple of last laps when they get. The shows. But my tyre are absolutely perfect still. I disagree with you, Jay, but I know why you're saying it. Oh, why, I mean, I, there'll be a lot of people that wouldn't have liked last week's daily race. Last week's daily race was definitely aimed at the more kind of hardcore is not a word I like to use. It was kind of more aimed at the sort of people who like the more kind of sim element of a racing game with the variation in the variables and the length for it. It was always going to be popular with the GTWS crowd rather than the casual crowd, let's put it that way. This one definitely will appeal to a, a wider audience. I don't think it's a better race, I certainly don't think it's ever near as good a race as last week, but I do understand why this will appeal to more people. Yeah, I mean, Watkins Glen, anything at Watkins Glen is pretty good, isn't it, Tonic? He's working for Lewis because Lewis is like proper quick. He doesn't look very quick in that 4C. I don't think it's suiting him. I think it's suiting McSpongy either. McSpongy was much faster than the Jaguar.
<laughs> oh, I didn't touch the old line there. There's no point following them round. We might as well put on a different one, a different lap. Yeah, 100% tonic, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the kind of opinion only an arty man would have. Well, Jay, no, no, Jay, Jay used to like arty, doesn't like arty now. Hopefully we'll jump either one of the Romeos. I'll tell you what though, more people need to try this NSX in the race. This car would be deadly in some people's hands. Absolutely deadly. Just messed up turn one, you absolute. Good wombo. He's not got there, eh? A one second as well! What a joke. We actually did a good job there up until one corner, didn't we? We did a good job there as well. Too many positions. How to absolutely wreck your race in one corner, folks. <laughs> one corner caused me five positions. Oh. Bugger. Annoyed at myself in that one. Well, it certainly wasn't an illusion of strategy, Jay. And what does any does that mean that uh, real races that are one hour become are they just like a one hour qualifying session? Then yeah. Well, that's a terrible comment, Jay. I'm sorry. That's a terrible comment. That's a terrible comment. That's that's one of your worst comments I've ever seen you make, Jay. I don't even think you've ever been that wrong in the world of tank streams, believe it or not.
Eve, welcome. Ah, that's annoying. That was a top. That was a good. That would have been a good top ten to be fair in a lobby like this, from where we started. So close though, isn't it? So close. Wind, what are you doing? You were slower than last time. Not good enough. And they've got up to third. Well, um, that, that's debatable, Jay. That is debatable. Real GT3 racing doesn't really have that much strategy. Oh, well, does it? Uh, I don't know. I need to watch more. Right, Jay, give us your uh, give us give us your wisdom. Tell tell me how last week's daily race at Spa in a fully dry race had an illusion of strategy. Go. Because if you don't give me a good if you don't give me a good answer to that question, you're getting timed out. Where was the illusion of strategy? Copying my phrases, by the way, that's my phrase. Let's just let's just hover the button over the timeout because he's he's not gonna he's not gonna be able to answer that question. <laughs> the chat is waiting here with bated breath to what Jay's going to write here. Oh, I am. I, that, that nonsense, I, I've used it in a video, Jay. I've used it in a video. I'm taking claim for the illusion of strategy. I'm copywriting that. That's mine. Any naughty corner. Yeah, there was, I mean, the, the rain was only dynamic to an extent. Is there any tyre variety in real GT3 racing, Jay? You don't have to have tyre variety to have strategy. You could, I mean, you could go, you, I did races where I pitted on lap 4 and 5, undercut everybody, got ahead of them when they made their pit stops on lap 9, 10 or 11, and then had to yield a couple of places to people on better tyres. That's strategy. That was me using the tyres to kind of get ahead in an undercut and, un, and maybe taking on less fuel to get ahead of people. That's, that's not illusion of strategy, that was genuine strategy in that race. This race has got like an, you can more say this race has got an illusion of strategy because it's a a pit stop where, well, you know what I mean. Well, not necessarily Jay, but given we were racing group 3 cars around Spa, like it's just say uh, the, the closest uh, comparison would be GT3 racing around Spa. Pit stop wasn't pointless, Jay. You had to do a pit stop and you had to change the tyres. Did you even watch any Spa, Jay? Or you do busy just trolling in the chat? <laughs> I 
I I said this race would have been better with 11 laps, but then I never realised that about the 4C. If it was 11 laps, it would just make the 4C even more OP because it would genuinely be the only car that you could do without changing the tyres. So, yeah. Yeah. The best solution to make this race better is to remove the 4C. Uh, I have not. I've not been on my Aussie account for a long time, you got her. Not been on it for ages. Uh, I have got sport mode unlocked and I, I have kind of uh, done a few races on GT7, but yeah. I genuinely just... Yeah, I, I used to chop and change accounts back in GT Sport, but on, on GT7 I have very much like 99% just raced on this account. Right, Jay. You need to go and play Project Cars free then. <laughs> you heard it here first. Pit stops are pointless. In in racing, pit stops are pointless. You heard it here first from Jay. Yeah, if you made it fifteen laps, I mean, yeah, yeah. Decisions decided quite a few of my races last week, you call a strategy. No, there was de definitely, definitely some strategy up. True, welcome into the stream. This is just what me and Jay do, by the way, folks. We just, if I say black, he says white. If I say up, he says down. And we just have a, and we just like, he just likes to disagree with me and I like to disagree with him, but. When I see Jay in other people's chats, I know it's not just me, he just disagrees with everybody. But we still love him. You know. It wouldn't be the same without Jay. Now, I'm only I'm only cheeky to him online because he's six foot four. If I ever meet him in real life, I'll be nice as pie to him because he'll batter me. I've got this terrible feeling one day I'm going to be in a pub in Glasgow and someone's going to hear this East Coast voice behind me, Wombo. And I'm going to look around and go, this guy's six foot four. I'm going, Jay, everything I said about you, everything I said about you in, in the chat, I didn't mean. <laughs> if you say heavy, he says arty. Right, do you know what? We'll do this race and then we'll set a qualifying time for the, the last couple. the wabbits. Get the wabbits. Barks with a 51 name. Where's a 51 put you in the world? Oh, 100. Sparks guy. Got some pace. Don't know how he does it, because anytime I watch him stream he just crackies all the time, but um, Sparks, I'm only joking if you're lurking out there. I'm not, well, I'm not. You know, I don't, you know, I don't mean it in badness. Iris with the 86. See, that's not a car you see very often, is it? Two of them in the top 90 as well. That's true, Jay, that is true, but it's still. Still, it's still an impact factor. <laughs> I'm an angry bitch. You've got a stick as well, Neil. You've got a stick as well. And it's bloody stacked, isn't it? Jeez, oh. 
One, two, three, four, five. Oh my god, like, come on, people. Come on, people. Have some variety in your life. Yeah, six foot four, is that all? I do believe six foot four makes you taller than... Is it is something ridiculous? Six foot four makes you taller than 99% of people in the world, I believe. <laughs> Five, <laughs> yeah. Be nice now, true, be nice. It's all we're just having banter. It's just banter. It's not go it's not go throwing insults about. Aaron, how you doing? I know you were in earlier on, you said hello right at the very beginning, but nice to see you in the chat. Peace and love. Right, uh, let's have a good race here then, folks. I mean, look. A top 10 is going to be a result in this lobby, isn't it? In the wrong car. It's these drivers. Just go nice and easy the first few laps, let's look after these tyres. Five foot eight is above average. The average height of a male is five foot six. That's the average height. They're laughing. Yeah, we have good banter. Huh? You should come into the world with a tank streams are, and it's even more. Uh, Outlandish in there, so it does. This is the PG version. Same old problem, Dave. They need to uh, they need to split up the cars. The problem with the, the 4C is that in order to make it competitive, they've got to make it so light. Then gives it incredible tire wear. I mean, so many races, I mean, this race would be excellent if you removed a, I mean, a weird one. It's not like ridiculously OP, the 4C, it's just 
hit in the arse more than anything else. Especially at the end of the race. Having a 4C meta, so it is true. The Supra is the qualifying car by the looks of it. Although a Jaguar is P1, but most of the top 10 things are in the Supra. Supra chews its tyres up too much, so. This would definitely have been more interesting if they kind of made the difference between the non-tyre change and the tyre change like 1.5 seconds, like, as at some tracks. Unrealistic as it is, but they made, the, they made it more interesting. Basically a first person shooter in tanks and I've got another channel where I stream that. We have a good laugh, we talk about Gran Turismo 7 a lot in there as well to be fair. Ah, how you doing? I'm not sure, Matt, because I think if you made it 11 laps, then you'd really just make the 4C the only car that can do the non-tire change, and possibly make it even more OP, if you know what I mean. So I'm... I kind of... I was thinking that way myself earlier on, and then I thought about it, and went, no, because then you actually do eliminate... No matter, nice to see it. Yeah, I'd love to hear Jay playing FIFA. Well, he says I'll, I'm. He says he's. I'm worse on World of Tanks than he is on FIFA, but I'm not buying it. Here's Nate. Pretty decent lap. Neat. At some point, we may get in the fifty twos with us. Yeah, it definitely looks like quality with the Super. I've, I've not raced the 4C, so I mean, obviously it's pretty quick and incredible on tyre but I suspect it might not be the easiest car to get the lap time out of. I think it might be one of these cars that the aliens do a bit better in than the non aliens.
awkward distance ahead of me that we're not going to get past them. We're just going to end up losing time, I reckon. An awkward distance. problem being behind this car. It's so much faster than it up through this section that actually costs you time. But by the time you get to the top end, well hey, I used to break the rap real quick. Yeah, we're good to see you in there, Dave. Yeah, we have good fun. Sometimes I just kind of moan my entire way through the whole stream. Maybe off putting to a few people, but... That's how it's advertised. <laughs> Yeah, it was good racing, yeah. I mean, it wasn't ideal, we're holding ourselves up, but eh. Uh... The NSX can definitely fight with it, but it's just now as we get to this stage of the race, you go. My tyres are now kind of at that point where I'm losing time, whereas the four C's tyres are not really losing time. I get pushed into that. Fuck's sake, man. 
they followed you for like four laps without touching you, will it? <laughs> F1, yeah. I do see it sometimes, Dave. I am Scottish after all. You hear a lot more of them if you come into my other channel. <laughs> There. Big horse, how you doing? No idea, Hugo, but I'll take the 3DR. Side by side through there. I'll try and run away. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Eleven. Oh yeah, I mean again, you know, it's a stacked, stacked grid, isn't it? It's a stacked, stacked grid. Did Jack go from piece? Jack started behind me, didn't he? he go, he go from P60 to P9 in the Supra. That's a hell of a race. Bad. That P8. I'm sure he started behind me. That's a hell of a race by Jack and the, the Supra, I reckon. I think they've done a really good job there. Really good job. Jack's tyre wear is always insane though. He probably doesn't have, he probably doesn't, probably doesn't have to change the tyres. This is the thing, Dave. This is the illusion. ACC does not have a penalty system. Doesn't have. You can punch so if you punch somebody off in ACC, you don't get a penalty for it, do you? You just got a broken car.
Yeah, four four C's where it is, big horse. Yeah, you do occasionally get this a different pair in the same corner. I've seen that, yeah. Yeah, super is a qualifying car. Super is a qualifying car. <clears throat> so when we that's his fastest time so far, he's in the nineteens. But what about but what you make pit stops in ACCJ? Are they, are they pit stops pointless? How does ACC make Gran Turismo seem like an arcade game, Jay? Come on, answer me that one. Tell me how AC what what do you what do you do different in ACC compared to Gran Turismo? What do you do differently? There's a couple of things. There's a couple I mean, let's see if you're on the ball. There's a couple of things. Oh, no, that's just my storage, uh, <laughs> that's just the uh, in-game storage, Dave. Too many replays. No, they're not. Half the races in the LFM are just sprint races. So the pit st that's not even an answer, Jay. The pit stops are required, it's a proper sim. What does, what does that actually mean? I know you're just winding me up, Jay. I'm just I'm just winding you up back. <laughs> I'm just winding you up back. I don't think it is 100% more sim like. I really don't. I think it's like actually just the same thing. It's a driving game where you press the accelerator, the brake. You have to drive in a semi-realistic fashion to not die. You've got tyre wear in both. You've got fuel wear in both. You've got damage in both. You make pit stops in both. It rains in both. At least the force feedback in Gran Turismo when you know what the hell the car's doing. Unlike ACC, where you've got no idea whether you've got understeer or oversteer until you're getting understeer and oversteer way too late into it. Uh, no, I literally see them as the same thing. They're both racing games where you have to drive in a semi-realistic manner in order to be fast and not die. That's, that's, that's what I see. I'd love to know why it's 100% more a sim. Love to know. I mean, you don't even get pit lane penalties in ACC. You can cross the white line. That's one of the most... Sim like rules in a racing game, you don't even have to follow that in ACC. Right, what time we are? Half past eleven. Please don't, true. Please don't. Let's not use that kind of language.
Yeah, Grand Thrasmal's got traction control, yep. Yeah. ACC's got traction control. <laughs> you channel they did Wobble vs J one hour debates, yeah. We could talk about all sorts of stuff. Yeah, but even that's not consistent, Dave. Sometimes you'll kind of get a uh, no time gain, sometimes you will get a penalty in ACC. I mean, it's a better system than Gran Turismo, probably, for sure. But it's definitely not that, con it, can be, it can be inconsistent. See you later, you got it. Thanks for coming in, mate, appreciate it. No you, no, you don't, Jay. The fastest way to drive ACC is without traction control. The top lap times in the world are set on ACC without traction control these days. So. You are right. I mean, in a GT3 car, you should be using traction control. But I do, I, I, I do believe. I'll, I'll, re, I'll retract my statement. I believe the fastest times in the world are set on ACC without traction control. Yeah, but you can turn one of them off, can't you? You can turn one off, which is not realistic. So the fastest way to drive in the ACC, apparently, to, to turn off the TC that you can turn off. I don't know if you can turn both of them off. I don't even think all cars have got both though, have they? I don't think all cars have got both TC1 and TC2. I don't know, I don't play, I, mean, I probably shouldn't be voicing that many opinions about it. I don't even play it that often, so maybe I should, uh, you know. Maybe I should kind of dial back a little bit. I don't play to ACC very often, so maybe I'm not. I should not the best person to talk about it. I should not even be able to turn it off, Jay. How real unrealistic is that? You can definitely turn it off in the real car. 100%. Alright, I wonder how stacked the next one's going to be, folks. Pretty stacked. stacked stuff. Who's actually streaming at the moment? I think Key, Grove streaming, Rory streaming. We swatch. <laughs> yeah, I don't know either, Jay, to be fair. <laughs> I don't know either. <laughs> oh, Alright, it doesn't get any easier, that's for sure. Wind, Manu, Key, Nikito, Elias. Sonic's in, Alasa, Grove, Matt's in as well. Actually, just. Maybe I should go and play ACC. It may be easier than being these bloody lobbies. Great Dane, welcome.
Does anybody ever watch Gamer Muscle? Do sim racing. I quite enjoy watching him because he's such a. <laughs> I like because all all the all the his streams just descend into slagging physics off in other games and force feedback and arguing with his chat. It's quite entertaining stuff. I don't know if any of you have ever watched Gamer Muscle whilst he's like streaming ACC or I racing or whatever he's playing at the time. He's a total AC fanboy. Like the original AC. If you, want a, if you want a good kind of listen and debate about kind of physics and force feedback and stuff and comparisons and games, Game of Muscle is always quite entertaining. I'm going to leave traction control on just for Jay. Even in a group four car. See, it slows me down. Well, we pit this time because we keep losing time because we can get compromised by people pitting. Guarantee Zape's going to pit. Has to be up here, right? I, I had to cut it that way. I was, if I kind of turned, I was going to lose the car, so I, I had to cut it to not die. Anyway. Your chance, this one's a last place then, isn't there?
Jeep's left. You couldn't take you couldn't take the guilt of ruining my race. Couldn't take the guilt. A good point, Demo. This has a good point. I racing doesn't have textures. I'm kidding, I'm only joking, I'm only joking. Fuck this pat lane, honestly. Shouldn't be allowed to pat when there's a car half a second behind you. It's the, it's the C word you've got to watch out for on uh, World of Tanks. Dave doesn't slow me down on this car. Definitely not slowing me down. 
don't know why people think traction control slows them down so much, I really don't. I don't think it makes any difference on this car. Too much traction anyway. Go in fun place. <laughs> <laughs> anyone in particular. A word you really shouldn't say, Dave. To be fair, a word we use a lot in Scotland, not always in a bad way, but... Not a great word to say. What lap it was there for in that corner? Uh, if you're asking if I was in the Royal Tank Regiment, is that what you're asking, Dave? Classified. But I do like tanks.
last. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Certainly not far off it. Deep's fault. Oh yeah, an awful with the tank station last night, Jay. Wonder what you were blaming fun police for. Is that Rory? That's fucking shocking. Disgusting drive. That one's in the locker, that one's noted. That one is noted. Nakata, welcome to the channel membership. Thank you for joining the channel. As a Wombo officer as well, nice one. How are you mate, how are you? Tough, tough, tough sessions out there. It's too stacked to not be in... Well, I mean, I think the car's fine, to be fair. Just starting at the back. Starting at the back and against drivers that are you're not going to really make that much time up on. I guess maybe we set a qualifying time. What was the qualifying times for that? Why do we need to start somewhere further up? Even though if I'll be able to do a fast enough time in time. Right, we'll do one more. One more. wasn't last. Keep skating fine for being a channel member for 17 months. Shall we go in for a Tiger next race? <gasps> You're saying, I don't mean this offensive, but you aren't a last to first see. <laughs> so why I'm not trying to go from last to first, Jay. 
I'm just trying to have fun. I'm not trying to go from last to first. Not at all. And it's only because this, the lobbies are so stacked at the moment, Jay. Yeah, it's only... That's the only reason. I, I didn't expect the, the lobbies to be quite so competitive this morning. I was kind of thinking this morning it would be okay to at least make some progress. What's that last to first see though? What's that last to first see? I don't know what that is. What does the C stand for? Or is it just what we were talking about? Nah, it's noted, Dave. Do not worry. Noted. Beyond, how you doing? Oh, we seen you in a race earlier on. Uh, Beyond, so we did. <laughs> not if I think. Not if you mean what I think, uh, Jay. No, don't say it, don't put it in the chat. You're right. Change all. He's still racing, Bjorn, yeah. Down in the abyss. One fifty two two gets you mid pack. I mean, I don't even know if I've got time to do that. Have a, we'll qualify for the next one though. Next, uh, I'll be stream. I'm going to stream again tomorrow, folks. So I'll do some qualifying later on, or uh, for the stream, we'll go with a qualifying time tomorrow. But uh, you know, I'll, I always do the first stream without qualifying. As I said, I just didn't expect it to be quite so stacked today. That's all. Well, there might be two more. I I I need I can't I can't play for too much longer. The uh, my daughter wants to do some VR, so she's going to do that this afternoon. Uh, and I I'm going to I was going to stream World of Tanks tonight, but I might stream this again. I don't know. I don't know. But I, before I get this one started, I need I need to send her to the shops. So I'm going to get her ready to send her to the shops because I need Iron Brew. So she can earn she can earn her VR time. So uh, I'll be back in a minute, folks. Dave, I'm not entirely sure what time trial you're talking about, by the way. We did well in the weird time trial uh, one, but are we still one and two? Uh, I'm not changing the tyres, Bjorn, no. Uh, but Dave, I'm not entirely sure what you're talking about, mate. Let me know in the chat. Back in a minute, folks.
Michael Dora, how you doing? Arkeys as well. Right, you two, honestly. If you can't be nice to each other, stop talking to each other. I've never had to do this in my streams, having to remove people's comments. <laughs> welcome in, Arkeys. Welcome in, Kildora. Nice to see you. I've not watched it back, Rory. It, it didn't feel good at the time, but uh, don't worry about it. I haven't, I haven't watched it back either, but uh, no, no need to apologise, just racing. If I, if I send one on you, though, in the future, you'll know why. Let's put it that way. <laughs> uh, but as I said, I've not watched it back on the replay either, so I've no idea. No idea. Oh, we've been dropped down a split, so we have. Been dropped down a split. Overtaking's never allowed, Jenna. Don't know why you think overtaking's something you do in racing. No overtaking. I'm not allowed to be overtaken, Jenna. You can overtake other people. Nobody's allowed to overtake me. That's the rules. Oh dear, we've got some people not very happy in the chat, eh? That's fine, don't complain about my move when it comes back then, that's all I'm saying. Bus stop raves. Is he done? Does he manage that? Arties. You can tell me how to turn the rear view mirror on in this view, I'm all ears.
Kar hao hi dil mein. Bloody Hatley keeps costing me positions, doesn't it? What a lot frustrating. Working as usual. Ah, we're all good, mate. We're all good. We're all good. Right, Yes, the driving with a uh, lack of respect might be in there today. That guy in the rack so I'm here, yeah, I'm explaining it. <laughs> oh, it's been an interesting stream, that's for sure. Interesting stream. Thank <laughs> you. 
lost 12 seconds with that, uh, that spin. Kind of hard to make that back up, isn't it? On the bright side, we'll be on our way to DRA, the way it's going. And then we won't need to qualify. We'll just get races like this. It's amazing when you go down a split, the, you know, the amount of people who are clearly changing tyres. Something to get banned from me. Well, I think I've only ever banned one person ever. He, well, from his comments, he, I didn't appear to like Scottish people. Let's put it that way. And then I seen him doing the same in Dale Boys chat a couple of months later, so <laughs> clearly. Clearly my ancestors must have done some to his ancestors in the past. <laughs> Half the team is South African there, isn't it, Ledge? <laughs> I heard about it though, Dave. I did hear about it. <laughs> well done. EGs to Thank it. Oh, 
That's the dot where you break. Welcome back, Neil. Nice to see you again. Nothing pretty well, but I don't think it's going to be enough to not come in the bottom two or three. Just can't afford to lose 12 seconds. No, I've never seen that true. Didn't see that. I can't, I must have been a long time. Love 53 at last, doing well done. They're going to come in the top 10, I'm not entirely sure how. He's got a half second pain on the head, obviously. Might not be close enough. The penalty up here. There's a P7 on, is it? <laughs>
This goes to show you the difference in quality between the lobbies, doesn't it? It just goes to show there's a huge gulf in difference between like the first and the second split. And without the 12 seconds loss, we probably come P2 in that one. Certainly P3. Cer certainly top 4. Probably fighting for P2. We were actually faster than P1 as well, because we were... Uh, we were pulling away from him after they pitted. It's such a huge gulf in difference, isn't it? Yeah. I take it these uh, rugby players then, they kind of, I don't know, they kind of all want to play for Scotland to get British citizenship, is that, the, is that the idea behind it, Lesh? Is that why? Is that why they, uh, they all want to play for Scotland? I don't think we're getting a P9 out of that. Right, I need to go and kick my daughter's backside and get her moving. A six second penalty mark, wow, I did wonder why you were kinda of there, I did wonder. Easy. Yeah, exactly. There's quite a few of them here as well, Tank Bro, to be fair, but not as many, not as many. Much better selection of cars, to be fair. How did you get a six second penalty mark? What did you do to get six seconds worth of penalty? I have parents or grandparents or sittings. Okay. <clears throat> but why would they not want to play for South Africa? Surely, like, more chance of success with them than us. Surely, there's a popular race. What sort of lap times are you doing in the NSX tonic? What are you doing in clean air? Probably like over the first six, six, seven laps. What sort of lap times are you doing? Yeah, don't worry, well, I'd have been more annoyed if I'd lost the position to the Supra because of it, Mark. But the Supra was too far behind. Six seconds apparently. Did you get oh the double whammy? The double whammy on the pit. Yeah, I'm doing like 53 4 is kind of moving my best lap in non slip. Yeah, you good pace, you get better pace than me then, Tony. the double whammy.
Oh yeah, Petley and I. At the start. I didn't know who it was. I don't like a car. I think it may be this guy. Anyone get any ideas? Is that, like, is that a fan attack bug or something? Is that a bug on a wheel that anybody's aware of or something that does that to you? A strange one. <laughs> How's the DR looking? Ah, it's still, I've hardly lost any DR to be fair, despite the fact that I'm struggling to even get a top 10 most races. I think that's a fan attack, yeah. I know this special spell and all of it, eh? <laughs> I make a short of that, yeah. Yeah. Right, we are doing that with the... The daughter, she's, she's off to the shops. I can do another race while she's doing that, so... Maybe even another couple of races. This is took a turn into quite a long Gran Turismo stream. <laughs> does that count as a pit stop? It doesn't, no. You can't actually do that, Kildora. Yeah, you can't, uh If you try and pit before the race starts like that, you just effectively do a drive-through. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought true, that maybe he'd spun and the wheel was sitting like that or something. But it didn't look like it from the... the didn't look like it from the inside. Into the 54's halfway, alright. So I'm, I managed to stay in the 53's right up to lap 7. You still racing, Tonic? Yeah. No, it doesn't count as a pit stop tank, bro. No. No, you hundred percent definitely can't do it. It'll just drive you through the pits. Only the NSX had close to 4C tyre wear, yeah. I mean, you more want to kind of bring the 4C closer to NSX tyre wear. What does the 4C actually weigh? What's the weight difference between them? Is it, is it something, is it quite ridiculous? Best way to bring it up, yeah. Best way to bring it up to the blooming.
Just try to find the difference in weight between the. This way, yeah, boom, boom, yeah, do it. This way. Right, we're still in second split. This is this is more like our pace. We've got our Spanish friend behind us. Do anything silly again? Ali's in. Mark's in. Group in four. Four C weighs. 1,000 kilograms, watch. That's why, I mean, that's just stupid. It's so much lighter than everything else. The only other clock card that closes to Audi TT, but it's FF, so it just destroys tires. This is the NSX way. And it's nearly, so yeah, the NSX is nearly 350 kilograms heavier than the God, I wasn't even on the chat, Tonic. Cheers, Tank Bro. <laughs> I was I was on G, I was on a different page, Tonic. Yeah, I'd agree, Jay, you always get a meta, but you don't want it's it's it's, it's a weird one, this one. The 4C is just such a weird car in this race because it's really only the last two laps when it's a, it's a total pain. Silly rear wing on a Sylvia, you just deserve to crash it. Here, but it may be a bit boring if I pit. Might as well. Maybe a lot of women. Maybe a bit boring, but it's the way to do it, isn't it? Yeah, it has a lot of difference, doesn't it? Yeah. We are uh, nine likes away from 100, folks. Anybody fancies hitting that like button? Maybe you've forgotten, maybe you haven't. Hit the dislike button then. No, if we can get to 100, uh, 100 likes, that would be nice.
nice and easy in these corners. Nothing to gain. We've got my uh, old burrito. Jaguar up ahead now, if they've pitted on that one, they're going to struggle with my tyres. Fix the 4C for tyre where I've been. I don't know. Give it 200 kilograms of ballast and offset that with horsepower. Really be a good start. <laughs> make it 1250 kilograms and give it an extra 50 brake horsepower or something to make up for the additional weight. Might work, I don't know. Oh, you faker! Did not see that coming, I'm not going to lie. I did not see that one coming. Get an ACC spin. Shit, my car's spinning. I didn't get any warning. Pretty much, yeah. We probably have horrendous rear tire wear as well, that's the problem. Yeah, I don't know how to fix that. That's the problem we have in cars with such different weights and power characteristics in the same category, isn't it? You have to uh, balance one with the other, and if they're coming from a very far away stand starting point, then... Gee, but they tried it again, we're ready for it this time though. Definitely a car that's had uh, caused uh, PD problems for a long time because it's had some massive changes in BOP updates in the past.
this too, mate. Just spun me out in the last one, maybe. Thank you. What are you the same was coming, one of the two, eh? <laughs> Appreciate the back so though. Short shifted Neil, can't say I'm an expert on that car though. Right, Jaguar to pass next. I'm going to kill by the chicane again. Yeah, I've got to be careful there now, getting a, a wee confidence lift. And we go down the outside, what do you reckon? Give me the room, fair enough. Me to board him to Tidgeney now, did he? He's racing though, and he's racing. Possibly not, nay, possibly not, but I felt we just had like such a speed difference over them that I thought well, they might give it up, but yeah. They've been Spanish in TCR, I might not have done it, nay. <laughs> to here. Oh, 
was oil on the road there, Ali. I went wide as well. Genesis. Hey. Feeling some. Everybody's pitted. Maybe, well, maybe well, P1's not pitted, maybe P2. I'm in a safe place though. Last lap coming up. Yeah, Rory. Yeah, Rory. Just down dead sides. Give a fuck. I'll do that, Rory. <laughs> Side of, but we'll grip out there. And it's amazing how many people that call me wobble. That's pretty much it, isn't it? That's pretty much it. <clears throat> yeah, I was, uh, I, it was just a drunken conversation with some friends and I called a Wombo. And I went, well, if I was a Wombo, I'd be the Wombo leader. Then I think, like, literally the next day or the day after, I was setting up my PSN account. It's like, well, I'm going to call myself ah, Wombo leader. That's that. It's, it's got a ring to it. We can call ourselves that. And, yeah, the rest is the state is history. No worries, Ali, no worries. Good race with you, good race. Next stream, whoever wins car should use in the next race. I've just been a bloody 4C the entire time, true. <laughs> that was a good race though, that was enjoyable, that was enjoyable. 
Much less sweaty down in these uh, taken split, you know. Right, well, I can do another one because I'm waiting, waiting on the daughter coming back from the shops. So I've got time to do another one. So uh, I think I will. I think I will. I believe I lost DR for that though. Harsh. Seems it's a bit harsh. Yeah, it's been an interesting stream, David. It's been an interesting stream. It's had a lot about everything. There's a little bit of everything. A little bit of controversy in there. A little bit of getting taken out a couple of times. Had some animosity in the chat. Well, animosity from the chat. You never have anything that's like animosity. Uh, yeah, it's been it's been an interesting one, David. But overall, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Had a couple of well, I've had one P seven. Yeah, I'll just, honestly, I'll jump in the next one. We'll do one more. Then. Then I'm going to go and get something to eat. I'm going to drink some iron brew. I'm going to set the VR up for the wee one. She can play that for a while. I need to go and visit the dog, make sure the dog's okay, and then I'll be back for a stream tonight. Probably World of Tanks, and then I'll do Gran Turismo again tomorrow morning. But that's not 100%. 100 likes as well, folks. Thank you for 100. Well, we, uh, we mix it up, will we try something different? Is that Scotty? <laughs> that sounds like Scotty stream true. The guy just sits in the pits. That's a, that's a Scotty pit stream. <laughs> you know what? Let's try the expo. Oh, come on. Would it really be a Group 4 stream if I didn't drive the Jaguar at some point? I don't think it would be. Yeah, that's when Scotty does quiz there. Where was it he was racing, honestly? I jumped back. I jumped into his stream about five or six times and every single time he was in the pits. Can't remember what one it was, though. Yeah, actually, you know what? Shelty is in there with a shout. Let's try the Lambo. Gonna kill the front tyres though, isn't it? Gonna kill the front tyres. Maybe we just pit though. Maybe just change the tyres. Gonna be back already. Why not? We'll try the Lambo. Oh yeah, I have seen that. True, I've seen that. It's okay on tyres, is it? Is it quite light, maybe? Is it a light car? It's no Alpha such an orbit. Is it as good as the NSX? Uh, Totti, how you doing? G70 is a faster car, but you'll need to change the tyres. Yeah, the G70 is pretty good, isn't it? I used the G70 at the Austria, the Red Bull run. This is the problem with the Lamborghini, is it's insane view. We need to get used to driving from this view now. I don't know why you're like so high and kind of pointed down, but it's definitely a bit off putting.
Hvor det er det SX flyder jeg også for sure. Anders styre. Det er bare en lyste. Det er sådan. 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 Det er You can see quite a lot. realize how nimble that NSX is sometimes. <laughs> Slower than my race pace in the NSX. Gee, I'm not sure this was a good call. I guarantee I get fired back into top split for driving this as well. Give it a rest, you two. They are buying top split. I don't think it's nowhere near the stack, but we've got Oscar. Maybe it's, maybe it's not top split. That's going to be an easy win for Oscar, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know why Oscar's down here. So it's going to get bad DR. Oh, why? Either that or top split's super, super, eh. Uh, super stacked.
Rosies, welcome to the stream. Yep, good luck to you too. Qualify, they said. Qualify. Blame Shelby is what I'm here for. <laughs> yeah, it's what, it's what Tidsley does as well, isn't it? We'll be fine. We'll get a top. I can, I'm telling. Oh, we'll get. I bet we get a P7. I'm calling it now. Yeah, I've seen that demo. Yeah. To be honest, I wasn't having the best fun in top split. It was just a bit too sweaty. Such a weird view. It really puts me off. Driving, just weird, weird breaking points and driving. I had to bloody take a void in action there, it kill him. There's weird driving, but it's just the difference in kind of consistency in the way that people drive, though. <laughs> it's like. Definitely different. <laughs> this is like driving a Lamborghini tractor, yeah. Why was that finish driver off the faking track, miles off the track, and then that pit was bloody chaos?
Right. We can still recover, though. Still recover some. <laughs> You're not far off it, me. Not far off it. That's about pace though, this car. They can do low 53s. I was not as bad as I thought it would be either. It really isn't. I think we did say that. This is the last one though, Hugo, definitely. We're going for the not pit strategy. Front tire is going to be very good by the end, though. I mean, it's not going to be terrible, but.
Naya Jax in front of us. Is there a top 10 on? I imagine everyone behind us has pitted. demo <coughs> catch you later man Oh, 
फाइव टाइम Driver's daily not that bad on this, is it? A four-wheel drive car. I'm very surprised, actually. Disappointing, man. Disappointing. Oh, I, I, uh, <laughs> so I think that one. Uh, leading DR here with bad races, silly mistakes. That's what it is, though. Bimbo, how you doing? Welcome in, mate. Welcome. See everyone, thank you for all the likes as well. 110 likes, there's not been a lot to like this one to be honest with you. It's been a tough, a tough day in the GT office. Tough day in the GT office. I had to just, I, honestly, I'm so annoyed. Driving was just so weird on that first lap, and then <clears throat> just had to, had to take a void in action to not kill that guy at turn one. I definitely broke in time, I didn't break too late. I had to, had to throw the car to the left, it is what you've got to do in those situations. Uh, I've tried the 4C, you just can't get on with it. Yeah, I was saying that the other on, Bambo, it strikes me as one of those cars where, uh, like, not everybody's going to get the pace out of it, and I think there's a lot of people driving it in these races where they might be better off with something else, to be honest with you. Clearly a fast car, but maybe, maybe not for everyone. Eh, uh, no, I never changed tyres in the Lamborghini. It was actually okay, Rosie's. It was actually okay. Surprised me how good it was. Maybe we did miss for breaking point. You never really know until you look back on something, to be fair. 
Yeah, I broke before the 200. I'm just closing up on that and let... Uh. I don't know what this guy was doing. What went on with this? What was going on with this guy? Did a mere. Did an absolute mere. He started up and he started up. Right. Wait, watch maybe one of the worst first laps in history. He had an absolute nightmare, hasn't he? You're not quick in the Supra either. Try the NSX, Bembo. Yes, he did. What she said. The NSX is really nice. This guy starts in pole position. The bus stop for the first time. It's a wrong. Oscar's down the inside. But dirty tires. Half second penalty. Off the track again, oh no! Another position, gets another half second penalty. Then P4. Lighting, you're clear. Not really. Let the P7 now from pole position. Oh dear, that's <laughs> self inflicted as well. Off the track here. But I don't know why he didn't just pit at this point. Why would you not just pit after all that? Another half second penalty. And now we've got E and the Supra coming down the outside. Then <laughs> he did the same as me. <laughs> Have a shocker. <laughs> It's enough, you got a penalty for that. When did they actually finish? And then they quit the race. Jesus. That is bad times, isn't it? That is some bad times. Anyone who says they haven't started pool and had this panic of getting swallowed is a bare faced liar. I know, yeah, I know where you're coming from there. I'm not sure I've ever kind of melted quite as badly as that, to be fair, but. Yeah, I said he's not very quick at anything. <laughs> Sylvia, if anything else can have horn. Fun honking the horn. Yeah, I mean, if you're changing the tyres though, Bembo, but you, you maybe as well in something like the Jaguar. I think the Jaguar's maybe get more raw pace than the NSX, and if you're changing the tyres, just pick the car you can go fastest in. Horrible feeling, yes. That's the sort of feeling I get when you go into a race and you start the race and you've got Monster, Tokyo Lopez, Romero, and maybe two other aliens that starting behind you and you're like, oh yeah, I'm going to have so much fun for the first lap, ain't I? I'm going to have so much fun for the first couple of laps as these guys bully me and wake their way past me. That'll be a similar feeling there. Right, folks, I am going to wrap it up there. An interesting stream, interesting stream. I'm going to go back and watch a couple of things back on replays, see what I think of them. Yeah. I don't think we've ever had somebody coming into the chat from other streams and kind of giving their opinions on something, so that was a new experience. I'm not sure I liked it, to be honest with you. I had to kind of bite my lip quite hard to not say anything that I really wanted to say. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, interesting stream, good fun, quite a long one as well, four and a half hours, that's quite long for me on Gran Turismo 7. 
But yeah, I'm off to go and get something to eat, do some other things, and uh, yeah, I'll be streaming either World of Tanks or Grand Turismo. We'll see how it goes, but yeah, you folks, enjoy the rest of your afternoon, enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, I do appreciate your company this morning and this afternoon, uh, and all the likes and niceties as well. But yeah, until next time, folks, take care. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye now.
just you.